Record straight, no pun intended. When I was Labor Secretary, the National Enquirer ran a story that I married Elizabeth Taylor while skydiving over New Mexico. I'm a heterosexual. I don't know why I just said that, except that as of this morning, I'm the most famous, not famous, but apparently the most powerful lesbian on the planet. And the fact of the matter is I'm crazy, absolutely crazy about this particular man I just met and had two fabulous dinners with in the space of one week. A man who hasn't had the courtesy to call me today, probably because he's simply of the undependable gender, or come to think of it, maybe he has even less of an idea about how to deal with my alleged and fictitious lesbianism than I do. So he'll just remain silent like a submarine under the ice cap and drift away. Just drift away like a legion of other cowards whom I spent my young life staring at the phone, panting like an exquisite collie, hoping for table scraps until I became successful and suddenly started to scare them, scare them with the very independence they required me to have. So that now I'm looking at some bad numbers, really rough stuff, if you know what I'm talking about. But what was I supposed to do? Turn down an opportunity to serve the president of the United States who I believe in and adore? You just want to share it all with someone, you know? So if you want to send them any more call sure. sheets. No, that'd be a great idea.